Mic check one two one two. Cloud tokens here. Make sure you subscribe for more content. If you don't, I will harass you in the comments. This is a known fact. Do not test me. I right, salute. So At this point, I'm convinced that 95 percent of these rappers are mentally challenged. These dudes be having millions of dollars, millions of fans, and still risk their life for some street shit that they worked to get out of. That they sat in the studio for hours or in a homemade studio in the basement, sold drugs or did robbed, whatever the fuck they had to do to get out of the hood. You make it out, you get rich, you get famous. Then you do the same shit you was doing to get out of the hood. If that's not retarded, I don't know what the fuck is. But as y'all know, Lil Durk and King Von, aka Dumb and Dumber is getting charged with attempted murder and the courts are saying they got probable probable cause to charge them with attempted murder there's a video showing Lil Durk and King Von shooting guns and shooting a dude and he almost dies and you can hear the prosecutor explaining what happens then you're going to hear the defendant Defend his clients, which is King Vaughn and Lil Dirk. Circumstances really unfold in kind of a, a close environment. There is a physical struggle that begins inside the passenger compartment of that car. The victim is trying to get away and being pulled back. There is no evidence before this court of any fag or any mystery item that's being pulled or brought over by the victim. Instead, this court has evidence that the victim was attempting, they were attempting to rob the victim inside the vehicle. Um, there was enough victim to get away and instead all three of the um, defendants that we've been discussing are a critical part of what happens afterwards which is that they attempt to gun this man down he's shot on the side of the vehicle sustains a very serious wound um, loses a significant amount of blood court heard testimony that he was struck in the femoral artery and then as a result of that he kind of collapses there at the club entrance outside of one cigar lounge this court heard testimony that mr banks and mr bennett are active shooters on that scene they are on that scene they are not just in a vehicle they are not unaware of what's going on but instead they're both outside that car at the rear of the car as the fight's going on mr banks there with the gun mr bennett there with the gun and then instead of pulling off uh, mr banks pulls forward Forward, extends his arm out the driver's side window of that car and fires multiple rounds in the direction of the victim. Uh, Mr. Bennett is on foot firing rounds again in the direction of the victim, which is, of course, uh, more than enough evidence of the intent to murder, the intent to take a life. I'm asking that this court find probable cause on all of these counts um, for the commission of criminal street gang activity. This court heard from a detective from the Chicago Police Department, and I wanted the court to hear from this detective because it's the Chicago Police Department that originally documented these individuals, has knowledge about the way this organization works and the types of crimes. The criminal street gang Black Disciples to conduct or participate in criminal gang activity by shooting at the victim, Alexander Witherspoon, as his co-defendant shot and robbed the victim. There is no link that's been given except pure speculation that he's a gang member or he self-identified years ago. If this is going to be enough even for probable cause to say this is further from gang activity because the Atlanta officer couldn't tell you. They said talk to the Chicago guy. The Chicago person says I have no idea. That count cannot survive. I can't argue about um, the possession of a gun based on the blue arm that was sticking out or what this a um, lady may have seen or may not have seen. So we're not arguing about the possession of a firearm during the commission of a felony, because that's certainly a jury issue. But criminal attempt to commit murder, I can't um, argue with that because he said the blue arm may belong to Mr. Banks. I understand that. It's just like, be smart. Every rapper is going down. Rico charges, it's over with. If you get caught with a Rico charge, it's over with. No matter if you couldn't, you didn't have to commit one crime, but you told your homeboy to commit a crime, you are the boss, you're going to jail. It's to the point where the feds will take you down for anything. And it's in the law book, so you can't do shit. So why keep doing crimes when you're already rich and famous? 
I understand you're an underground rapper. You ain't really making much money, so you gotta still commit crimes or still sell drugs. Why the fuck are you doing it when you're rich and famous? Now, this is a crazy story. <laughs>